In this video, we will go over requirements for the body of your APA paper, including general in-text citation format such as one author, two authors, three to five authors, six or more authors, short quotes, long quotes, and paraphrasing. Please note, all information mentioned is based on the sixth edition of the APA Style Guide. Whenever you refer to someone else's ideas or work, you need to cite it. The information you will need for an in-text citation is the author's last name, the year of publication, and the page number or page range of quotation. For a single author, the general format would be, or if what you're citing spans multiple pages, you use two P's followed by the pages. So your entry may look like this. For two authors, follow the basic style for one author, but separate the author names using an ampersand. For three to five authors, list all the authors in the parentheses the first time you cite the source, using commas to separate and an ampersand before the last author. In future citations, you only need to use the author's last name followed by et al. If the article has six or more authors, use the author's name followed by et al for an in-text citation. There are three ways to incorporate someone else's ideas into your paper. Short quotations, long quotations, and paraphrasing. To incorporate a short quotation into your paper, you must include in this order the name of the author, the year of publication, and the page number from which your quotation is drawn from. The page number is preceded by a P to indicate page. This citation will directly follow your quotation. You may include the citation at the end of the short quotation. However, if the author is named in the signal phrase, you must place the author's name before the quotation followed by the year of publication in brackets and the page number at the end of the quotation. Here are two examples of how this can be done. A short quotation should never stand alone, but instead be incorporated into a sentence to demonstrate a specific idea. A long quotation is considered 40 words or longer and will be placed in a freestanding block of typewritten lines. Start the quotation on a new line indented half an inch from the left margin, in the same place you would begin a new paragraph. Type the entire quotation on the new margin and indent the first line of any subsequent paragraph within the quotation a half of an inch from the new margin. Maintain double spacing throughout. The parenthetical citation should come after the closing punctuation mark. When you are summarizing or paraphrasing an idea, you must make a reference to the author and year of publication in your in-text citation. It is not required to add the page number, but it is encouraged by the APA. This concludes the preferred tense and quotation format video. Please check out our other video tutorials if you need more help.